All right, here we are. Haunted Finals. A best of three. This series qualifies for Worlds pretty stacked. 3-2-3-V and 2-7-7-5-V on the Red Alliance as the lower seed against 5-1-5-R and 4-0-8-2-B on the Blue Alliance. 5-1-5-R specifically has looked practically unbeatable this tournament coming here and uh, sweeping the elimination. Their shooting is looking credible. But 3-2-3-V and 2-7-7-5-V, no slouches. They pulled a few hard matches in the elimination, made it through there stronger. See how it goes here in the Autonomous, as one of the red robots not going to move. Big shots from 4082B onto the goal. 515R doing some shots too. Blue going for more volume than accuracy. A lot of the shots are going to go skip wide. So much velocity there, going to make it hard for them to settle inside that goal as it gets filled up. Both sides get rollers, but I think Blue might have gone over the line or something, because they do lose this Autonomous. Um... And the driver control is going to start up here. 2775V picking up some discs. Going to start off the shooting. 1, 2, 3, real quick. Blue Alliance also shooting. Both sides leaving themselves, but quick scuffle in the far corner to get those rollers. 323V electing to leave it. Going to go back to shooting. And 4082B content to stay there in the, on the goal. Not going to go for rollers yet. Still a minute. 25 seconds left. We're very, very new to this match. 2775V here in the near corner getting rollers. They're going to go back now to shooting. Blue Alliance already almost done their shooting. Their, their, goal, their goal is getting mighty filled up. So 4082B goes into the near corner there for the rollers. A minute, 10 seconds left. Both sides only have one robot right now on shooting. Other robot going for rollers. Good defense from 515R in the far corner there under 323V. They're going to try to stop them from getting rollers or from shooting. 4082B here stopping 2775V from getting rollers and controlling both of the rollers. Content to sit there. But as they move away, 323V makes a run behind them. Can they get that one roller? 4082B. Loses one roller there in the near corner. 1-1. One, one. They're going to block the other one. Maybe try to wait until 3-3-3-V backs off in the far corner. We are seeing a bit of a scuffle. 5-1-5-R pinned in the corner, but they get out and they get both of the rollers. Now rollers in possession of blue in the far corner. Near corner, the, the rollers are also in blue. 4 0 b doing a great work here pushing. 2-7-7-5-V. Or no, that's 3-2-3-V. That's, that's doing a great job pushing 3-2-3-V three, three, off the rollers. They lose one, but they get it back now. 3-2-3-V three, three, pushing 4 0 to b trying to get away around them, but they can't as rollers in the far corner are even 1-1. One, one. And 3-2-3-V three, going to rotate around to try to help them. Scared away by 4 0 to bs incredible driving there in the near corner. Eric just pushing and pulling in the right direction every single time. But 2 7 5 v does make a run. The roller mech not working. It didn't work earlier in this match. And they're not able to get it, and they can't expand. That was a big mistake there uh, from the Blue Alliance, but Red not able to capitalize. 2775V did get passed, but they just couldn't roll that roller. The rolling mech uh, malfunctioning for some reason. Don't know exactly why. And uh, Blue is going to end up winning that match. 2775V doesn't even expand, but 323V, I think they do get their expansion off. And uh, 515R, absolutely class expansion right there. ton of strings getting out onto the field. Uh, shooting, also an advantage of Blue. I believe there. And they've got the rollers in the end. Great defense from 4-0-8-2-B. We'll see what 5-1-5-R and 4 0 to b can do in the second match. As this is best of three. 3-2-3-V, 2-7-7-5-V. Going to try to clap back and see if they can make the adjustments here in the second match. Let's get into that. Here we are in the second match of the Haunted 2022 Finals. Blue leading 1-0. 3-2-3-V, 2-7-7-5-V. Absolutely shut out there near the end. On the rollers in the near corner by 4082B. Absolutely immense driving from 4082B in the near corner. It is much easier to drive and control rollers in the near corner. Uh, 515R putting a momentous effort in the far corner, doing good work and getting one of those rollers. But um, the, the the near corner, or for uh, the red alliance, that would have been their far corner. They had some trouble there as 4082B was just pushing, pulling, and vying for those rollers in just the right way. I don't know if they went over the line right there, uh, but again, more shots for blue, a lot more shots. As red only has one robot going for the autonomous, they're going to go for their their uh, other roller. And both sides do get one roller. Uh, each robot, so that's two rollers. And blue is going to end up winning that autonomous there with their superior shooting. Bigger volume of shots. This driver control is going to be starting up here. 3-2-3-V. Three, three, Qu three quick shots right there. On their goal, 2775V, going to come support both sides again uh, on their own side. But 4082B actually elects to leave 515R to shoot blue ahead and shooting already in the first 15 seconds here. And 515R left completely on their own to shoot 4082B, got both of the rollers in the near corner. Now they're going to go for some defense and rollers in the far corner. 
leave 515R, who are confident in filling up this goal on their own, not being defended. Red just sticking on their own side. Their shooters are not working as well as 515R. Still behind on shooting uh, is, is, uh, is Red. Blue pulling ahead even more. These slow shots from 515R doing a great job in filling that up. Forza Ray 2B just kind of sitting outside of the red, uh, the red high goal, outside of the blue low goal. Uh, waiting, looking for something to do. Great push from them there. Right in the last second, they push 2775V or 333V off of that shot, and they miss all three shots there. Huge from them, as Blue is way ahead now in shooting. 515R is not being defended at all. 4 0 to be there in the far corner. They're going to race here to the near corner. They're going to try to defend those two rollers they already have from 2775V, uh, who were fighting them last time. Oh, no, that's that's 333V, I keep on forgetting. Uh, who were fighting them last time, and they get them off of that very nicely. Get both of the rollers. 4082B last game had some great roller play. And they do lose one of them, but they get it back fast enough to defend the other one. They're just so fast in getting those rollers back. And Red Alliance just doesn't have an answer for that. They don't seem to have as quick driving, just getting outdriven here in the rollers. Shooting is behind. Red has to do something here if they want to force a game three. But it looks like 4082B, they do let them through, but they get back as 323V did overshoot. 4082B push them into the corner with a little spin and expand class driving there from 4082B. That was that was dominant. I haven't seen I haven't seen roller driving like that ever. That was um that was that was an incredible run of play there near the end. 4082B just doing spins around 323V forcing them where they want them. And in the very end there, did a nice little maneuver where they, they had them overshoot past into the corner, trapped them in the corner. The last 10 seconds, you are allowed to trap for an infinite amount of time. Trapped them in the corner there. They could not expand, and 4 to b got their expansion off, and both of the rollers there in the near corner. And 4 0 to b also uh, got more shooting, as they, they, they let 515R do most of the shooting there in the game. 515R undefended by Red. And so Red, not doing any work to curb the Blue Alliance's shooting, not doing any work to outshoot them, and not able to win the roller game there in the near corner, and so they are going to lose that match. And here are the scores for that match up there. 515R and 4082B taking it 241 to 323V and 2775V is 142. A tremendous effort from the Red Alliance. One I'm sure would have worked against slightly lesser teams, but 515R solo shooting there in that finals two match where they 1v2'd the shooting and completely outshot Red. And 4082B's insane defense uh, in, the, in the corner, in the near corner there for the rollers to completely dominate that, just put them way ahead. And Red just didn't have a response, didn't have a uh, creative response, couldn't throw Blue off their game enough. And at that point, Blue just does what they do better and win.